Yo, what's up guys? I am so fucking hyped for Dark Souls 3. I hope you guys are too because I plan on bringing some Dark Souls playthroughs to the channel. Let me know how you guys feel about that. And I know this is mainly an MMO RPG focused channel, but you know, Dark Souls is something that I'm very passionate about. I have always loved the Dark Souls series. To give you guys a little background, I started off playing Demon Souls uh, shortly after it released. Now it's because me and my friends, we grew up on Monster Hunter. We were diehard Monster Hunter fans. So every game that released after our love for Monster Hunter, we tried to compare it to that game to justify our reason for playing it. And when we saw Demon Souls, we were like, this has some big ass monsters, you know, it has like sword shields, let's play it. You know, it's like Monster Hunter, it's co-op. Nothing like Monster Hunter at all. But you know, we were young and we got it and soon realized how hard that fucking game was. But I've never played a game so challenging and like so dark and just quiet, that kind of atmosphere that Demon Souls, you know, gave us. And so from then on, my addiction was there. We played Demon Souls. I don't know if I beat it when I was younger. Maybe, maybe I did. I, eventually I beat it like multiple times. But when Dark Souls 1 came out, you know, I was in high school, I was working, me and my friend, we... It was on a school night. We stood in line for a long ass time to get our little collector's editions and shit. You know, I miss being able to stand in line for a video game. Those were very exciting days for me when the hype was real like that for Borderlands 2 and, and other games like that. And so we got Dark Souls. I was so drained from work that day. And then I had school in the morning that I couldn't even play it right away. But man, just that excitement knowing when you go home from school, like I'm going to go so fucking hard in this game. Eventually, you know, I got every trophy uh, for Dark Souls and then every achievement for Dark Souls. And then Dark Souls 2 came out and I was super pumped for that. But honestly, I didn't like Dark Souls 2 as much as I like Dark Souls 1. And I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just me getting older and you know things have slightly changed as far as just the the same excitement that i can get for games when they come out i don't know if that's it i hope it's not it's kind of a form of depression you know i do remember playing that game for 18 hours straight the first day it came out so i mean it still had me addicted and then bloodborne came out which i was kind of hyped about but it took a different route than dark souls and i never even beat it because I just don't know. It just did not get me addicted. I did like the atmosphere. I like the gameplay and everything, and I still got it. I just actually bought it again for PS4 the other day, but still never beat it, and nothing in me is like, you know, let's not play Black Desert. Let's go play Bloodborne. I don't know what it is, but Dark Souls 3, I'm super pumped for it, and I love sharing my experiences like on Twitch, live streaming it. I wanted to know if you guys are hyped for Dark Souls 3, and if you want to see some gameplay on this channel and if you do i want to know how you want to see it you know sometimes or most of the time i usually make these videos where it's just the gameplay and i do voiceovers which is cool it's the most immersive experience for you guys and i've decided when i do these playthroughs i'm going to cut it to the important parts you know i'm not going to show every single death or every single boss fight when i keep dying to them and have to retry and retry but, you know, I'll show you the important stuff, and the videos will probably at max be like 25 minutes, 20 minutes, or something like that. I'll try to cut them down. So, the choice was, do you guys want the most immersive experience, was it just the gameplay and my voice, or do you want it to be kind of like camera in the bottom, like I'm showing right here? It might not be in the bottom, but wherever it fits, it doesn't block the Dark Souls UI interface, you know? Or do you guys want the green screen? Now, I can break the green screen out. I haven't used it yet. But, you know, that means I have to have these super bright lights on in my room and go through all these settings and configurations with XSplit or OBS. And I don't know if it's all worth it. Just let me know. If you guys really want to see me but you want it to be more immersive, I will use the green screen. So I'll put a straw poll up and vote. And if you guys don't want to see this on my channel at all, you know, just you can vote that as well. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. And uh, as always, it's great talking to you. I look forward to comments and I'm going to try to respond to every single one as I always do. So I'll see you guys in the next video.